Hello everyone, my name is Sean from Mizuno Ken Studios, and how you guys doing? Right now I have the last few little bits of my $300 mystery content opening for Yu-Gi-Oh! So what I want you guys to do is I want you guys to A, enjoy the video, and B, please like, favorite, and comment for, of course, your interactions. Please subscribe to see all the latest and hit that notification bell to know each and every time. I pop up on YouTube with a new video. So, with that being said, let's begin. Excuse the slight whirring in the background, it's just the exhaust unit and our little townhouse here. Um, what I have here are three small little packages. So, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys real quick. I have this little small one here. I have this one in the, I guess the, um, the little wrap. And this one here in the, um, just the box. So, I really hope you all enjoy the video again. Just, um, just gonna go ahead and open these guys up so you guys can see what's going on. And, well, I'll be right back with you guys as I get these open and cut. So, let me get these cut, and I will be right back. Hello, everybody. I'm back, and as you can see, I just cut everything to where it's just, like, openable and easy to pull from out of the boxes and a little package there. I did not look at any of the content. I just opened it to where it's easy for me to take out. So just to keep the integrity of the video, that's what I did. And also to join me here, I have, hello, my Gem Mint 10 Legendary Collection 4 Joy's World Pink Token. It's a cheap token. And somebody's going real crazy like Need for Speed out there with the car. But we'll start with the biggest one first. Just one second. So you see the interior right here. Just a sec. Okay, guys, there it is. I'm sorry for shaking the camera a little bit. And I do apologize in advance. I'm probably going to be shaking the camera a lot from my current setup. It's right up, um, right in front of me, the camera setup. So we have like some classic cards that like Remove Trap, Dark Energy Fusion Weapon. Got some nice little commons here. Um, level 3. Dark Factory Mass Reduction, that's a good card. Solar Duelist, um, Dark Mimics, Rock Over Grotto, Decay Commander, Burning Algae, of course. That was, that was Rebel Yato. Put that back. Super Robo Lady, Claw Reacher, Familiar Knight, Remove Trap, Ryu the Illusory Gentleman. Red Eyes Black Chick, before it was pre errata well, Let me get the camera to focus a bit. Okay. Ryu Kish Empowered, and there's the exhaust unit again. Flame Swordsman from Starter Deck Joey. And I like Joey's deck setup because, I'll just go through here. Flame Manipulator, you need this to make Flame Swordsman. I like Joey's setup again because it was kind of cool how he had all the tough guy cards in there, like all the warriors, like, and he didn't really care about levels, he just cared about summoning. Oh, Metamorphosis from Pharaonic Guardian. And this is in, for it looks, lightly played, very lightly played, just a little corner there. But yeah, Metamorphosis, that's a $4 card, like $4.70. Like, Meta, Arm Dragon Level 3, Mountain, got some cool cards. But yeah, I like his particular setup, Violet Crystal. Finally, I got one that doesn't look like a proxy. And this is from Legend of Blue Eyes, of course. Chaos Greed, Blessed in the Nile. Some nice cards, like Glasswell, Nobleman. And I'm going to cross out. Secret Pass of the Treasures, that's like a dollar now. And it's in first edition from Ferrana Guardian as well. Get a Jumbo Black. D Tribe, Vampiric Orcus, Solar Flare, Dragon. D Spell, Gradius Option. Got Harpy Lady. Ooh, Harpy Lady. Um, this is bef this is the original version, as you can see. It has. Hold on, let me get the camera to focus real quick, right here. Come on, focus, Harpy Lady. Okay. Now, if you see a card, a Harpy Lady that looks like this, um, they put on a top to her so that way it doesn't show her cleavage. So that's gonna be like. DNA Transplant, too, that's a, that's a card, too. 
So this is worth about maybe um, maybe a dollar. Harper Lee, a dollar twenty, and then DNA transplant is worth about two dollars. So I'll put those right there. I move those over for right now. Put those right there. And yeah, it's just yeah, the pre errata Metal Raiders Harper Lady had the cleavage showing. And then they edited her to put on a top so that way it doesn't have any more cleavage. Ring of Manism, Pineapple Blast, Vampire Genesis, nice. Buster Blader from Oh. Great condition too. And it's a battle pack ten. Buster Blader. So this is an excellent card. That's worth about that's worth about four dollars, five dollars. It should be worth more. Mind on air, Urabi. The Tornado Powered in a White Dragon. Kyozanryu. Lester Dragon 2. Urabi again. Mikazi. Faramita Cross Fissure. Battle Ox White Dragon Ritual Food. These are from Star these are from Star Trek Cap Evolution. So that's a that was a good first stack right there. But wow, the Battle Pack 10 Buster Blade, that's pretty. My camera's being weird. I don't know why the um it wants to not show the Harpy Lady. I I guess. You know, it's just like a little precursor to not show cleavage. I keep it PG thirteen on this channel. <laughs> Trap jammer. We got some traps here, Vampire Lady. Seven tools. A lot of normal polymerization. Gather your mind. Broke doll, but this is ooh, it's poor condition. I put the poor condition cards over here. Um, trap master, compulsory for old imp. That's some nice cards. Labyrinth tank, fusion weapon again. Mystic tomato, dark titan of terror. Koji Kosi, <laughs> like a little Viking guy. Tainted wisdom. All you need now is ancient blade. All you need now is ancient blade, and you can make um, leave a skull knight. Red archer go, skull knight too. Fissure, Ravi, Root Water, Mahavala, Frenzy Panda, Rod of the Mines. I am Pixie Knight. Got some more comments. But, I have a feeling that the best is yet to come. At least for this one here. And, I am prepared to make this a big video. And, if the camera does cut out, I will make this a two or three part video. I'll just, edit, I'll just add this first part and then put in the second and third part if there is. Spirit Caller, by Choose, Princess of Sudugi, Legendary Jujutsu Master, Jujutsu Master, Invasion of Chaos, Ojama Yellow, and Warrior One, Tripwire Beast, Spexedra, Spirit Reproduction, Recycle, Mass Driver, Gorgon on Reverse Trap, I've seen this in a deck in Duel Links now. <laughs> this is full, oh, I got two of them. Crawling Dragon, Tribute to the Doomed, Guilty of the Night, Beast Fang, Armor Glass, Stealth Bird, Burst Breath, Mystic Tomato, or Mystic Tomato, whatever have you. The Jin, nice. Jar of Greed, Spirit Ryu, Not So Beast, Sitting Experience by Fissure, and Spirit Ryu again. So that's a good stack there. Hold on a second. Let me go ahead and do this real quick. Okay, guys, I'm sorry about that. Sorry for shaking the camera. But again, please prepare for a lot of camera shaking, so. Kagemusha the Blue Flame. I wish that Kagemusha the Six Samurai. That's a card I'm after. 13th Grave. Karate Man. Hmm. Ooh, it's stuck to Babonic Vermin. I stuff on it. I put it over there in the played category. Some of these are Masaki, the Legendary Swords, and this is the other one for Flame Swords, and Mr. Clown, the Tultime Giant, Abare Ushioni, which is pretty cool, Hane Hane, Giant Trunade, of course, Heavy Storm, Misaru Zame, Trap Seal, Prohibition, Shadow Spell, Red Moon Baby, before it was, now it's Vampire Baby, but before, this is pre errata Cross Counter, Wandering Mummy, Lord of Dragon, or Lord of D. Level Up, non casting Area, then Experience Spy. The Stern Mystic, of course. A Cloth Scorpion, the Lower Swords of the Ale. Spirit Ryu, the Human. Chusuke, the Mouse Fighter. KA2 Death Scissors. Mad Sword Beast, Scarlet Bird, Hanahine, Celtic Guardian. 
from the starter deck Yugi's Celtic Guardian. Honestly, because he was like a warrior, it probably would have been better in Joey's setup, but let me go ahead and take out the rest of this card from out of here. Well, didn't really expect a whole lot, but... Yeah, this is the last little bit of it. Try to get into one video. So, I'll go through these real quick. Dramatic Rescue. Light of Intervention. In Japanese, A Ray of Revealing Light. God. I don't know why the camera is like, struggling to focus. Yeah, Master of Oz. Things about a dollar on its own. Stray Lambs. Perfectly Ultimate Great Moth. Ooh. Oh, oh no. It's not good. From the Secret Cards, TSC, Megaton, Magical, Nibumamonga, Sangan, Magic Jammer, Solar Ray, I, like, I love that card. Sphinx Talea, which is a, which is a hologram, holographic card. Over my cross out, Stab of Instruction, Heavy Storm, Despair from the Dark, Master Dragon 2. I don't know. I thought it was the hologram version. Sorry about that, guys. Tunes, Tunes and Skull, Red Eyes Tune, Rare Metal Dragon, Tune World, Tune Mermaid, Cyber Jar. Ah, but it's very uh, heavy played Cyber Jar. Armed Dragon, level 5, called a Mummy, Dust Tornado, and Book of Life. I tried to say it like Camula, but that's okay. Yeah, um, I favor Camula. That's okay. Of course, um, it's pretty cool. <laughs> but yeah, it's, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, you know, it's, of course. Big Wave, Small Wave, Mystic Clown, Dream Clown, Dark Asana. We got some nice little cards in here. Koji Kosi. Got Aitsu, Soul, Soul Eater, Regenerating Time Meter. That's in a. I'll put that in a play category. On Sut's <laughs> Summon Skull. I started like Yu Gi Oh! Wish it was. Ooh, level up. Not good. From the looks of things, I might want to level down. Rare Gold Armor, I think this is about a dollar. And then Metal Silver Armor. There's Rare, there's rare Gold and Metal Silver. So sunlight, Silver so Completed, Just Desserts. Taunt, Paladin, White Dragon, Precious Cards from Beyond. Oh, Dragon, Big Wave, Small Wave. You know, you know just, some, just some common cards here. And then the last little bit from this collection here. Got Riram, Cemetery Bomb, Absolute End, Castle Walls, you know, Rude Kaiser. Hidden Book of Spell, now it's just called Hidden Spell Book. A lot of intervention. Ooh, just a lot of trap cards and stuff like that. Hmm. The first sarcophagus. Shame how this card isn't worth more, but it is a hologram, nonetheless. An experienced spy. Wow, Hinotama's soul looks like the bomb from Final Fantasies. <laughs> Trap Master, Mammoth Graveyard, Mechanical Snail, and Witty Phantom. Huh. Which was more to that. So to recap real quickly, we got Rare Gold Armor, DNA Transplant, Metamorphosis, Harpy Lady, pre -errata. Got the first sarcophagus here. Vampire Genesis right in the middle. Sphinx Talea and... I will have to put Buster Blader as the marquee car for here. Great condition from the Battle Pack 10. Very wonderful card. And I think it's in probably the best rarity you can get. Honestly, I feel as though having Buster Blader in the Secret Rare, I feel as though the Secret Rares are some of the best rarities you can get it. Other than Ultimate. So. Secret Rare that. So that will be the that's the first package. Now, 
I am going to go through the second package real quickly. And I'm going to go all the way until my camera cuts out. So if this becomes a 30 minute long video, that's fine by me. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and take care of this package next. Let me go ahead and open it up real quick. Okay, everybody, I'm back. Sorry, I just, I just want to make sure I got the, all the other common cards from the last set out of the way. But as you can see, the, the next one put them in the little bag. And I see that they're all individually sleeved as well, which is excellent. So I'll split them in half for right now, and I will go ahead, put those down. Oh my goodness. Sorry for the camera. Nice sleeves, by the way. And let's go ahead and start with DD. D. Wave King Caesar, Serenui Sun Saga, DDD Dragon Bank King Beowulf. A lot of DDD cards in here. Got Oblivion King, Abyss Ragnarok, Neo Galaxy I Cipher, Curse King Siegfried, got DDD Savant Copernicus, Savant Galilei, Seventh Galilei, I'm sorry. Got Doom King Armageddon. You got. DDD Supreme King Kaiser, Chaos King Apocalypse, Sousa Soldier from our first old school card here from Legacy of Darkness, Giant Germ, Vampire Lord, Summon Skull, which is nice, DDD Cerberus, DDD Seven Kelper, Seven Newton. Wow, just a lot of DDD cards here. Fairy King Truesdale. This is from the World Championship 4. Game, Delta the Magnet Warrior, Tiger Dragon, Time Wizard, Launcher Spider, ooh, it's not in good condition now, Lord of Dragon, Blizzard Dragon, Magician's Valkyria, Time Gazer Magician, Wattail Dragon, Fushino Tori, Kazagliden, another Vampire Genesis, put those right there, Stargazer Magician, Karibo, Odd-Eyes Pendulum Dragon, Dragon Caller, Mobius the Frost Monarch, nice, Blue-Eyes Toon Dragon, uh, but it's not in good condition, so we have to put that over there. The Tricky, Mango Ryu Ram, Predipant, Clamido Sundu, nice. Ooh, Legend of Blue Eyes, Curse of Dragon, but that's not in good condition either. But I will put that over here. Sometimes I wonder if they actually take care of the cards, because look at this Mahavilo here. that just messed up, and they just expect to make so much money off of it. Dark Arm Dragon, Vampire Lord, Gather Dragon Champion. Serpent Knight Dragon, looks like in decent condition. Ruran, Empress Mantis, Skull Lair. Performa Pal, Slate Hand Magician. Performa Pal, Second Donkey. Hip Hippo, another Performa Pal. And now we just put those right there. Move those over here. Put those right next to them. And we continue on. The second stack. Got Long. Yeah. Long Foam Bull, Lomon Carpet, Hans Dandakun, <laughs> Performed Power Dramatic Teacher, ooh, Black Lursa Soldier, great condition, finally, Pyramid of Light, Crab Turtle, Paratrio, Performed Power Swing Cobra, King Bear, nice, Drummerilla, Performed Power Teeter Totter Hopper, Swing Talea, Theanin, ooh, Metaltron. 12, with your Draco, no, with your Draco Batten. This is not in good conditions. Pretty messed up. Raging Earth, Andro Sphinx, Tierra, so it's a Metal Zoa, but it has, I think it has a slight bend right there. Put that in the Yeah, anything that has a bend or whatnot, I will put over in the play count, play section. Vampire Genesis, Beast King, Barbaros, Blue Eyes. Blue Eyes to start at Kaiba. Ooh, I got a... Ultimate Rare Blue Eyes White Dragon from the... I'm not exactly sure where exactly this card is at, but... Moisture Creature. Buster Blader. Got some nice cards here. Desperacion de la Oscuridad. Despair from the Dark. Dark Magician. A Dark Magician Ultimate. Nice. Guilford the Legend. It looks... Well, maybe the... Okay. See Metal Tank, White Dragon Head, Gadget Soldier, Green Gadget, it's a cannon. Red Gadget, got all the gadgets here. Dark Hole from Legend of Blue Eyes, but it's in poor repair. 
Shane. Soul Taker, card destruction. See, that's even most of the hollows are in poor condition. That's at least like the fifth hollow I pulled out that's in poor condition. Scapegoat, Dragana Tactics. ADZ Dragon Buster Cannon, finally got one of those. Greedy Venom Fusion Dragon, Invoked Caliga. XYZ Dragon, Oh, That's, that's a shame, because that's bent right there. That, uh, I would even sell that. I really wouldn't. ABZ Dragon Buster. Fry for a Wolf. Fiend Skull Dragon. Chaos Ancient Gear Golem. XZ Tank Cannon. Fright for a Tiger. And XYZ Dragon Cannon. That one's probably the more disappointing set. And I really hope the other one is not as disappointing at all. But for that one, I will have to go between either the Blue Eyes or the Dark Magician Ultimate. Those would be the top two. Honestly, I will go for Blue Eyes right now since I'm doing the whole thing with Kaiba. But I will go ahead and put those over to the side here. One second. Okay, guys, I'm sorry about that. I just want to make sure to clear everything else up. You see the stack of cards over here. I just kept those over because I did get some nice little holograms out of that stack. I did get some nice foils. But... The top three out of that stack was these three. Blue Eyes White Dragon, Dark Magician, and Black Lesser Soldier. I know, I know two of these cards are from Yugi, but it doesn't really matter. Because, well, I think those are the best of that stack. I feel, like, I, th I feel as though I got stiffed more on that one than any of the other ones. But this last one could ever prove me wrong. Let's hope it doesn't. Okay, so we got... Ooh! This is a Yu-Gi-Oh! 5Ds... Oh, it's warm. But it's not that you couldn't find a use for it. Maybe it's just one small stack. But sadly, it is worn and poor repair. It's not really that much usable, so. I have Buster Blader right over there. Blue eyes right there. We organize that. And these, uh, I guess this is the last stretch of them. So. And go ahead and split them in half, flip that side down, and let's begin. You got Aether, the Heavenly Monarch. You got Erebus, the Underworld, you got two of them. Eidos, the Underworld Squire. Edia, the Heavenly Squire, I've been looking for both of them, and now I've got, looks like, three copies of each. Scapegoat, Time Star Magician, times three, Ghost Trick Alucard. <laughs> Housing reference. Darker Bell and Xyz, Gaga Guy Cowboy, Cancella Pletus, Cancella Hades, number 77, The Seven Sins, Lightning Chidori, Arai's Raging Dragon, Bahamut Shark, Bujinte Tsukuyomi, Satellite Cancella Diamond, number 2, Z Zombie Stein, nice. Ooh, nice, we got Carbonella Warrior, and Darkfire Dragon, Garlandorf, King of Destruction, nice. Garlandolf, sorry. White Aura Dolphin. Got DDD Super Doom King Bright Armageddon. Three of them. Dual Light Chimera. Sky Striker Ace Kaina. Incantation Chalice Line. Vendra Battle Lord. Oh, that's a nice looking card right there. I like the artwork for that card. Archivine Zombie Skull. Dark Highlander. Celestial Wolf Blue Sirius. Move Brainwashing times three. Adora Destiny. Three. High Five the Sky, Change of Spirit, Tachyon Transmigration, Paleozoic Leancolia, Aldonia, Paleozoic Hallucigenia. Yeah, I got two of them. And so, yeah, the Paleozoic cards are pretty cool, actually. Neat little trap monsters. Can't believe they came out of the whole archetype of them. Here's a third of them. Ryoku Field, Trap Tick. Trap Tricks Nepenthes. Got three of them. Mermail Abyss Lanty. Abyss Balane. Shurit. Strategies of the Necros. Destalos from Rise of Destiny, first edition. Nice. Apocalyphort Sky Beast. Stardust Charge Warrior. Junk Speeder. Stardust Assault Warrior. Assault Blackwing Raikiri the Rain Shower. Nice. Assault Blackwing Onimaru the Divine Thunder. Psy Flame Lord Zeta. Marshall Metal Marcher, another Siphon Rosetta, another Chidori the Rain Sprinkling, 
Buster Dragon. <laughs> That's kind of a... I figured they would probably make a car with the Buster in his name. Goyo Predator, Buster Dragon. Super Heavy Samurai Steam Train King, times three. Heavy Armor Train Iron Wolf. Number 71, Rebarian Shark. Kachi Kochi Dragon, Rebarian Shark. Got Majesta Paladin, the Ascending Draco Slayer. Kachi Kochi Dragon. <laughs> Another Ascending Draco Slayer. Soul of Silver Mountain. That's a pretty cool part there. Brotherhood of the Fire Fist Tiger King. Bujinte Susanoo. One second. There we go. Vendred Reorigin. Blazing Mirror Force. Blazing Mirror Force. True, True Draco Apocalypse. Radiant Mirror Force. Got Grand Horn of Heaven. Horn of the Phantom Beast. Another Grand Horn. We got, oh, oh boy, sorry about that. We got two, three copies of Flower Gathering. Flower Guardian, Zebra Grass with Moon. Willow the, Flower Guardian, Willow of Calligrapher. Now these reminds me of the Hanagama. The Hanagama, I'm sorry, Hanagama. It's uh, like a little card, like a little tapestry card. That's very popular in Japan. Flower Guardian Pine. Flower Guardian Polonia with Phoenix. Vampire's Domain. Sukumo Slash, Mechanite Indigo Eclipse times two. Got Monkey Board, Battery Man Solars, Master Hyperion, Link Slayer, Mate Spectre Total Gamma times three. Volcanic Doomfire, which is an excellent card to have. Performer Pal, Odd Eyes Magician, Odd Eyes, sorry, Minotaurus, Minitaurus times three. Pendulum Mucho times three. I know, Pendulum Mucho. So. That actually is the last little bit I have for the Yu-Gi-Oh! $300 Mega Content opening. Um, said this is a poor repair, but I really want, you know, probably find another one now. That's okay. That's Exhaust Fan signing off the end of the video. Please let me know if you like what you saw. Um, please like, favorite, comment for interactions, and please subscribe. Hit that notification bell too while you're at it, so that way you know each and every time I come up on YouTube with some more videos. And please, of course, support the channel in any and all forms. And I really hope you all enjoyed. So, thank you for watching, and I hope you all have an excellent day. This is Sean from Izanokan Studio signing out. Sayonara. Yunichincho.